But secondly, if you can really get jobs and understand how companies really run and take those lateral moves. I mean, I went from, I was a, first I was a systems analyst. First I was a programmer, systems analyst. I was a sales support person. Then a salesperson, I'm uh, switching companies along here, salesperson, sales manager, a staff person to a national sales manager. Boy, staff people have really tough jobs. Um, but you know, back in those days, you had to be staff in line and staff in line and do all that. So a staff person, back to a you know, senior sales manager, out to a marketing director, VP of marketing, VP of federal, VP of customer support, VP of a division, VP of worldwide sales and marketing, and then CEO of Autodesk. So the only thing that I have not actually managed in my career is manufacturing until I became a CEO. Everything else I've either done or managed directly. By the time I got to be CEO, I knew all the tricks. I wasn't, by the way, I wasn't the best customer support person. I wasn't the best finance person. I wasn't the best of any. I'm not today. Every one of my executive VPs are best at what they're doing, but I had done it all and I can out-talk any of them, and they know it. And it's fabulous, because it makes, it's a more creative kind of place to be. If I had just gone up one chain, the sales chain, the marketing chain, the technical chain, first of all, I don't believe I would have this job. And secondly, even if I would, I don't think I'd be very good at it. So this process of laterally moving around is very important. Sorry.